welcome back to my channel. My name is Marissa. If you guys are new, don't forget to subscribe down below. And also, you guys can go ahead and turn on the post notifications down below to be notified when I'm posting videos. So, if you guys don't already know who this is, this is my sister, Mariana. Hi, guys. And today, if you guys can't already tell by the title, we are going to be doing the Not My Arms Makeup Challenge. So, I'm going to be her arms. And then she's gonna be basically doing her face, but obviously, you know, with my arms. So also, my husband and my son are in the background of this video, so they might be a little loud because you're just gonna have to ignore that. Um, so yeah, we're gonna go ahead and get started. All right, you guys, so I'm back here already, and she's gonna go ahead and take over the video from here. Hi guys, so if you guys already don't know, my name is Mariana, and I am Maritza's sister. So we're gonna start off the video. First, we're going to be taking a um, Maybelline primer that we have a little bit to the right, a little bit to the right, and a little bit forward. Yes, and we got it. So we're going to take this, and <laughs> then we are going to put some on our hands, and we're just going to rub them together and massage that all over my face. Yes, and we're so... Oh, yes, basically. <laughs> okay. Okay, so I'm putting it all over my face and my eyebrows as well. You can't forget to put them on your eyebrows. Yes, and um, yes, uh -huh, on my forehead. Oh, and my eyeball. Oh, okay. So I guess I just like to put it in some random spots, you know? Yes, so we are done with that. Next, we're going to take our foundation. So it's ahead a bit, so a little bit forward, more forward. Yes, oh, and we are doing, we're doing my brows. No, you know, drop that, yes. Pick that back up because that's what we're going to do today. So we're going to open it back up and start off doing my eyebrows. So we are taking the Anastasia shade in, I think it was medium last time we did it too. Yeah, so it's still medium brown. So then we're going to take a small brush, a small angled brush. So it's right there a little bit. No, yes, no. Right there, yes. We got the brush and we're going to start doing my eyebrows. So taking a bit of the product, not too much. Oh, on my face. Um, we're going to put it... Oh. <laughs> Um, we're gonna take a bit of the product, but oh, I like to miss the cup sometimes because I just am <laughs> very uncoordinated. Yes, okay, so we're taking a bit, not the whole thing, because we're still getting. Because <laughs> we're so. Okay, that's fine, that's fine. So make sure it gets all over the brush, um, oh, aluminum thing, yes. So we're gonna start putting it on my right eyebrow, do you guys? So I like to feel my eyebrows before I start, just to let them, just to see what texture they are, you know? So I'm drawing a line that goes from the middle of my brow to the end of my brow on the bottom. And we are doing my hairline because I guess it was very splotchy, <laughs> so she wanted to cover some spots up. Okay, so we zoomed you guys in so you guys can see a little bit better. So now we're just going to finish up my eyebrow. So I think it was plenty enough what I got last time, so I'm just going to stick with that. So I'm going to finish up my left eyebrow now. I am just going to do... A line on my eyelid and on my forehead so um, oh and on my edge of my eyebrow yes and finish up that hairline because remember again it was really bad so we are gonna take the lid to the Anastasia thing and we're gonna cover back up next I'm gonna do foundation and the foundation is a little bit forward a little bit forward yes it's a little bit oh and we are doing the L'Oreal primer <laughs> thing. okay so now we're doing okay yeah we're finding the okay she found it or I found it actually I found the foundation and I'm waving it because I want you guys to see it very clearly. Yes, and I'm even putting my hand back. Okay, now I'm going to take my foundation brush and I don't like to put the bottom part on it because who needs that bottom part? <laughs> I, just, I just like having a miniature brush while I do my face. So I'm just going to take a bit on my hand or on the back of my hand and then I'm just going to put the brush in it and put it all over my face. So yes, let's start. So I honestly, I don't like matching my foundation color with my skin. I don't think it's necessary at all. Um, I like to be like, <laughs> like to be like a hundred shades lighter than I am just for the photos, you know, that I take. I honestly try my hardest to be flashback Mary as much as I can. So I'm just going to put it all over my face and yeah. And in circular motions, you guys can't forget to get your eyelashes as well. So yeah, I think I'm done with my foundation. Now I am going to move on with primer, I mean, no, I'm going to move on with a Tarte 
shape tape concealer so it's a little bit to my left i'm just gonna go ahead and grab that but i'm honestly having a lot of trouble looking for it because i just can't seem to find it i need a concealer i, I even drop it because i'm really dizzy right now apparently so i'm just gonna open that up and put that on my trouble areas that i need a little bit more coverage on so i'm gonna open that up put it on my forehead and then put some on my cheeks or under my eyelids, actually, not my cheeks. And on my other eye, obviously, like, looking the same. Okay, so that's all that I'm going to put on today. And I like missing it <laughs> because I just can't seem to find where it's at usually, you know? So, yeah. Now I'm going to take my concealer brush to blend the thing out. I just like using that miniature thing out. And I, I honestly hate the back part of it. I like to use just the miniature thing because I hate that. So I'm just going to blend this out. Just, oh, yeah. So now I'm just blending my face out with the concealer, so I'm doing it. So I also can't forget my forehead, because I actually, as much as I do like to look like Flashback Mary, I kind of want to look like an even Flashback Mary, not crusty one. Next, I'm going to take some loose powder, so it's a head, like a lot, so I just kind of need to bend over a lot, yeah, like that, and I need to get it, yes, I am proud that I got it, so I'm showing you guys very happily. So, so I got the translucent powder. And it's by Laura Mercier. So I'm just going to open it up and get a um, just a fluffy brush that I can put it on my face with. So I like using that. Um, it's actually by Danielle. This brush is by Danielle. I don't know what that is. <laughs> I guess. Uh, so uh, shout out to you, Danielle. So I like getting a bit of the powder and just putting it... A little bit yeah so I like missing it because I don't like having too much on it so now I'm just gonna put some on my nose and on my eyes <laughs> so now I'm just patting it on my other cheek as well make sure it looks nice and even and in my mouth you guys can't forget to cover up your teeth with this powder because that's the, my main step and then also can't forget to um, get your hair as well because <laughs> I love getting my hair in it so then now, sorry guys, I just had a little bit of trouble closing that because as you guys can tell, I just am not very coordinated today and I, I like just bending my hands and putting them together when I'm <laughs> nervous. So so now I'm just going to take this contour kit by Anastasia Beverly Hills and it's just a little bit of hair. I'm just going to show you guys because you guys know I love this palette so I like showing you guys before I use it. So then now, I'm going to open up this little kit palette thing, whatever. And I'm just looking at the colors, seeing what color I want. And then I'm going to take a, I'm going to use this Tarte brush right here. So actually I'm going to pick up a mascara <laughs> and I'm going to use the mascara to apply contour. Oh no, I found it. I found the brush I was looking for, guys. Thank you. Okay, so I'm just going to take this dark shade, or actually just the powder that was to on top. So I'm just taking the lightest color there is to contour because I want to have a, oh no, you guys know what, I did want to use a dark one. So now I'm done getting the color and I'm just going to contour my face, make sure I look nice and bronzed up. Um, as I said, I do like to use 100 shades lighter than my skin tone. I like contouring my hair because it's just my favorite thing to do. Now I'm just putting it all over my face and I think I am done with this. Yes, I am done. I'm very happy I'm done because... You know, I'm happy. Okay, so then I'm just going to take my Jaclyn Hill palette. Um, it's a little bit to the left, so I'm just going to go ahead and grab that. So I'm going to take it, and I'm going to show you guys. It's this palette, this palette. So um, I'm going to open it up. Wow, there's a lot of colors in here, so I am very happy to see this because it can go so great with a blue. You know what? Actually, I think I am going to want to do a blue today. So actually... I'm going to take a eyeshadow brush, just any that I pick up. Yeah, that one right there. And I'm going to get a light color actually to start off just so I can get a base. Yeah, I actually, I want burgundy. Sorry, I just like changing my mind a lot. So I'm just going to take this burgundy and I'm going to close my eye and just put it on my eye. Oh, since I didn't grab my, I didn't fill in my eyebrow very good, I'm just going to take this color and just fill it in because, oh, and my lower lash line. I like, love doing my lower lash line first. So I'm just going to take, oh, the middle, oh, hmm. I'm just going to take this glitter color now, my other eye, just to match the colors up because glitter and the burgundy look awesome together, you know? So now I'm going to take this uh, black color. It's a little bit to the right and yeah, just right there. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So I'm taking this purple color now. I hate black. I hate it. I don't know why I wanted it. So I'm just going to put it on my eye. So I'm just going to put that on. Yes, I think I'm actually going to go put it under my lower lash line too, just to define it a little more because the purple was a little too less or yeah. 
So then now I'm taking this, oh, the cardboard on from the box. We love the cardboard color. Um, actually, yeah, we're just taking this cardboard color. Okay, actually, yes, I found it. Oh my God, I'm glad. I'm done, I'm done, yeah. So I'm just gonna take it on my other eye so I can even the colors out. Gonna blend it on my lower lash line as well because I love yeah. blending it on my lower lash line. <clears throat> so I'm actually gonna go for a cut crease today. So I'm gonna go back to my tar concealer. So it's the Shape Tape Concealer again, like I said. And so I'm gonna take it and I'm gonna put it on the back of my hand because who doesn't love some designs on the back of their hand? That's enough, yeah, because I don't need a lot, actually. So then I'm just gonna take this concealer brush and put it on my eyelid. Sorry guys, I'm still closing it. I don't know why I'm really talking ahead of what I'm doing. So I'm just gonna take my brush and I am gonna pick it up, get the concealer from the back of my hand and I'm gonna put it on my eyelid. So let's just do that really quick. You guys will see me do that. So I'm taking on my eyelid and making a cut crease. So um, I actually yes. do want this to turn out really good. So I'm gonna try really hard and put it into my eyeball. So yes, I'm bringing it, patting it down to my eyelashes. Yes, bringing it up to my eyebrow. Same thing to my other eye. So I'm gonna go ahead and close my other eye and you guys will watch me do that. So yes, that's amazing. So after, I am going to take a shimmery shade from the Jaclyn Hill palette right here. I already knew what that was because, you know, guys, like I said, it was my favorite palette. I just always have it in my eye. Um, so I'm just going to take a eyeshadow brush. So I'm just going to take this, um, uh, actually, actually, yeah, I'm going to take this one right here. And this is, I, I just love feeling how fluffy it is because it's just super fluffy and it just makes me happy. So I'm just going to take this shimmer shade here so just put my brush down and i love cardboard shimmer <laughs> who likes shimmer i'm just actually gonna go with this very matte color now because i love matte colors so um i'm just gonna put that on my eyebrow set my eyebrow with it and actually in my nostrils too <laughs> i love putting eyeshadow up my nostrils so um yeah i'm just getting a little bit more of that color I, i'm pretty sure that's good enough so i'm just gonna put that on my other eyebrow just to even them up yeah, on my eyelashes, you guys know I love having brown eyelashes, so. So we're gonna close that palette back up, bye. Okay, so now we're gonna take my Maybelline New York Master Contour, just cause it has my blush on it. So I'm gonna open it up, and I'm gonna take my blush brush, and it is, right, no, that, I'm just gonna take my little Danielle again. Oh, no, 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 actually, you know what, here. It's all the way over there, yeah. No, right there, you, I got it, I got it, guys, yes. And it's very fluffy, and I just love feeling how fluffy it is. I'm gonna go ahead and take the middle color. Um, mm, yes, I, I'm taking the middle color, and I'm good with that, because I don't want to be a little clown. So, putting that on the apples on my cheeks. Yeah, that was pretty good, actually. So I'm, I'm just gonna redo that again to my other side. Yes, yeah, so you guys want to bake with it actually make sure it goes on the bottom so like that and I'm gonna take this Tarte Pro Glow um, Kit and also my little brush that I was just showing you guys. I'm sorry. I don't like I don't do my actions coordinated to my talking I always like do something first and then do the, what I'm saying next. I don't know why I do that So I'm just taking um, this highlighter color actually any that any one that I want which one do I want today I want the sculpt color so it's oh, oh that was actually the color stunner I'm sorry I don't know why I said sculpt I just I guess I don't like sculpt anymore um so I'm just gonna put that on my high up my cheekbone on like the high part of it yeah to highlight my face and I'm good with that yeah I'm good with that now I'm just taking a different whole different color um it's the whole top color now and actually, I don't want to say the name anymore because I guess I couldn't read it. Yeah, we're good with that. Who wants to? <laughs> yeah. So, I guys, I like covering my face in a bunch of powder. I, I want to not breathe, I guess. So, now I'm going to get some highlighter and put it on my nose. So, just on my nose, that's perfect. And then on my, uh, my Cupid's bow. So, actually, on my nose again. I love putting on my nose again. And on my teeth. Yeah. <laughs> And because I, I love wetting my brush with like my saliva, I'm gonna take my mascara. So um, I'm sorry, guys. I love poking my eyes with it. And there, my Maybelline mascara. Yes, I love this one because it's waterproof. Um, especially when I look like this, I want to stay looking like this all day. Yes, because I don't want to ever take this look off. Okay, so you're gonna be careful. And you're gonna open your eyes, and you're gonna put it on. <laughs> 
<laughs> you're gonna swipe up to the air. To the air. Okay, so you're gonna swipe up. I hate your eyeball. <laughs> We're gonna do the other eye. Yes, do your eyebrows, guys, because how we remember how we put that um burgundy color on your eyebrows. We want to make sure that that black looks good. Okay, on it. Okay. Alright, guys. So I'm just gonna take my eyeliner. Yes, I'm gonna open it up. This is actually not dangerous at all if you are looking at yourself while you're doing it, but I'm actually gonna take a risk and do it whatsoever. So I'm just gonna wave it in the air, show you guys. So then now I'm just gonna close my eyes and put it on my eyelid. So I love putting it on my, oh, I love defining my eyebrow with it because that's just the way to go. I'm gonna put it back into the jar and I can't find the jar, guys. I'm so sorry, I can't find it. Oh, I found it. <laughs> okay, okay. I, I found the jar after all, or the little thing after all. So I'm just gonna put it on my other eye. So I'm gonna close my eye and make sure I put it on my eye, so be very quiet and put it on my cheek <laughs> I'm actually gonna put it again on my I love doing that so I'm just gonna find the little jar and put it back in so I'm sorry guys I cannot find this I'm so sorry I'm just so dizzy I can't I'm sorry guys I'm just really dizzy and I can't find it I can't even see where it's at <laughs> I found it. I honestly thought I was gonna die or something because I just couldn't stop being dizzy. So now I am so almost done with this look. I'm just gonna take my um, primer and I mean, I'm just gonna take my, what is this? My setting spray, I forget the name all the time. It's by L'Oreal Paris. Even though I feel like it smells super ugly, I'm just gonna use it. It honestly yeah, smells yeah. super bad. And I love scaring myself when I put it on because who doesn't want to get scared while they're putting on their mascara? Oh, I'm sorry. You guys heard how scared I was. I said I'm scared. I'm going to close my eyes and I'm just going to finish putting the setting spray on myself. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Right. Yes, we're done with that. So I already had put all my other stuff away and then I crossed my mind that I also need a lipstick to finish off this look. So I just went ahead and grabbed this lipstick called I Love Sarai X Color Pop. So I'm just going to take this and it's a bright red. Finish off this look strong. I'm going to take it and put it on my lips. Anytime. <laughs> yeah, put it on my lips and put it in my teeth. What? I just love putting it on my teeth. Mm -hmm. It still goes in my oh, teeth. Oh. I love putting it on my teeth. So I'm just going to take a bit more of this color <clears throat> and put it on my top lip because I rarely got any on there. So, mm -hmm. Lift up my top lip with the brush thing is my favorite thing to do. So, I am done with this look, guys. I'm sorry I put all my other makeup away before I did this part because I forgot. But thank you guys so much for watching. Um, let us know how you guys like this video in the comments below. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and comment. We'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Post notifications and you guys will be... What are you doing? <laughs> Hi, guys. <laughs> and if you guys can't already tell by the title... And I'll go, go, go. <laughs> you're like this look, you're like. <laughs> really? It's by Laura Mercier. <laughs> what is it? And even though I think it smells like butt. <laughs>